Hey guys, Oro here, and today we're breaking Armored Core 6. This video features everyone's favorite boss, Belteus, the boss of the Attack the Watchpoint mission and the final boss of Chapter 1. Belteus is infamous for being one of the hardest bosses to beat, but we're about to make it a cakewalk. I'm only using parts that you unlock before each boss, so you can do this on your first playthrough. I started out by systematically testing every single weapon available against him. Some of them were surprisingly effective. Others, not so much. In the end, it was a toss-up between dual pulse guns and dual plasma rifles. The pulse guns are extremely effective against him. They have a unique property that shreds through Balteus's pulse shields. However, they have really low range, short mags, and a long reload time. The plasma rifles, on the other hand, have extremely high damage, range, and just about everything else you can think of. They turned out to be a little more consistent and much, much easier to use. Now for the legs, I was torn between going quads or tank treads. Uh, both ended up being really strong options, but tank treads let you turn your brain off a little more and was generally just stronger. So let's go over the final build. We use dual plasma rifles because they're bullshit. We use dual laser cannons on our shoulders for their massive burst damage. We use the Melander C3 head and tie-in body for their AP and stagger resistance. We use the Noct Try Her Arms. That's the best you're going to get. Because of their maxed out firearm specialization, which improves our target tracking. And our tank treads, so we can basically ignore all the boss mechanics. Because we're using tank legs, we don't have a booster. We use the Abbott FCS for its insane close range assist and the VP-20D generator for its energy firearm specialization, which boosts our energy weapon damage. Lastly, we use the terminal armor expansion that allows us to survive even if our AP falls to zero. You can unlock this from the arena and OS tuning. So that's it for the build. Now it's time to break Balteus. It's that easy. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe for more Armored Core 6. Stay tuned for the next episode where we continue to Chapter 2 and fight funny looking Roomba, aka the Smart Cleaner. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on Rubicon.